New England has had a long and lasting relationship with water. After all, the Mayflower landed here. It's had a huge number of America's Cup sailors, but now it's got mini speedboats. These are 13 foot little mini speed boats and we have a half hour orientation first. People get suited for life jackets, learn the rules and regulations that can be expected in the harbor. And then we uh, get you in the boat, a little five minute how to drive the boat, and then we're off. About, uh, about 20 minutes going nice and slow through the harbor. We see some of the historical sites first. Boston Tea Party is one of them, the Constitution is another one. And then we go out to the uh, no wake zone, where we get, oh, the wake zone rather. We pick up the speed a little bit and go fast. We'll go down to the airport, Logan Airport. We stop there and uh, people, f planes fly over your head. And they're very, very low, maybe six, seven stories high when they're landing. It's pretty cool. And then we go down to the uh, Fort Independence. After that, we'll go down to the uh, JFK Library. The boat over here, the Iroquois, is owned by John Henry. He owns the uh, Boston Red Sox baseball team. And of course, at Liverpool Football Club. Probably cost around 20 million pounds or a half an Andy Carroll. No joke at all. A lot of people come down, they have never driven a boat before, they're a little tentative at first, but when they come back in, they're like, they're like a pro, you know. And we have a narration, there's a lead boat narrates to you, tells you what's going on, and tells you about the historical sites, a little history on all the buildings and the areas of the harbor and stuff. Everybody loves it. We have 52 great, excellent reviews online, uh, and we're actually voted the fourth best tour in Boston out of 83 tours. So anywhere from awesome, you know, it was uh, fantastic, you know, they, 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 like, they like the crew down here too, the uh, crew people are very hospitable to them and, uh, you know, do a good job making them feel comfortable in the boat. Well, I can honestly say that's the most fun I've ever had behind the wheel of a boat and I refuse to believe that there's a more exhilarating way to see this fantastic city 